Hi everyone, it's time for Vlogmas number 10, and that's the one where it's so nice, it almost feels naughty. everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 10. And this is going to be our winter Fab Fit Fun Box for 2023. It's the one where it's so nice, it almost feels naughty. I wish I could do just that one eyebrow that goes up like a fish hook like Joey does on Friends. That would have been cool, but I can't. So anyway, that's the box. It's Vlogmas number 10. So let's get started with the outfit of the day. So we've got this little headband type thing on. We've got this little springy tree here. It's got a little gold star. It's got some red balls on it, just on a headband. And then we've got this red netting all around it. This was from Amazon. Could have been two, maybe three years old. The earrings that I have, and I'm going to do the wrong one again. I can't get one to stay straight, but these are just from Timu. Nice and sparkly, nice and fun. This is a necklace that I got from Belk a few years ago when it was on the after Christmas sale, so it's all these kind of poinsettias. The dress, I believe, was from Kohl's a few years ago, so it's like an off-the-shoulder or cold-shoulder dress. we got these little bows right here. Why it's going to have a cutout there beats me. I don't know. Just a little sweater straps right here. We've got that kind of eyelash uh, kind of yarn right here around the neckline here, around the cuffs on the sleeves, and around the hem of the dress. So just that eyelash so it's nice and fuzzy. Uh, it's got green and red mixed in here. Kind of like a sweetheart neckline. We've got a pretend black belt, and I love the sequins because you know Nancy loves her bling. And then just some red and red and white stripes. So that is my dress of the day. Could be. Is it the ugliest sweater you've seen so far? Yeah. So we'll have a contest. Somehow we will get this described someplace in this, and we'll do that at the end. So again, this is going to be Vlogmas number. 10. So I've already got my item out from Glossy Box. And you know, at first when I got it, I said, you know, I've got this before. I gave it away. But, you know, because I don't wear nail polish and what, 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 what am I doing? I'm wearing nail polish. So I may end up keeping this. So this is from Glossy Box and it's NCLA. And it's kind of like this, kind of like a movie taupe color, maybe you would call it. So a nice neutral shade. So it would be a really nice everyday shade. This stuff that I got on from OP, and I know everybody says it's like the best, um, within a day it comes off. So um, I left it on for a few days and yeah, basically came off by itself. And so I put it back on. Uh, this morning I used um, a base coat and I've just got one coat on. And then probably before I go to bed tonight, I might put on another coat, wait for it to dry and then a top coat and see if that makes it last a little bit longer. But this looks like a really nice shade. So I think I am going to use that. I know that's a little lengthy to say I'm going to use this. We got from our Waka our shortbread cookies right here. So we've got this square one again. This had some really nice toffee bites in it. Toffee bits in it. So, so good. And I'm so lucky because it was already cracked. Broken in the container. All the calories leaked out. I'm good to go. Alrighty, and then from the fabulous Just Jenna, we have got from our Nutcracker Chocolate Advent Calendar, we've got another one of these thick, chunky milk chocolate delights. Little bits of heaven. So, so good. For our coffee of the day, from our Crazy Cups that I got from Amazon, we have got the Holiday Spice. I don't know why. This never really wants. There it goes. Just when I'm giving my web cam crap it focuses maybe i should do that more often so it's holiday spice it's a medium roast coffee i will have this in the morning all righty so oh yeah my wine how do i always i i almost forgot my wine last time too so anyway i pre-opened this just so i wouldn't have to struggle on camera 
and this one is a red blend from California. It doesn't tell me what the mix is. The one that I opened last night was a Cabernet Sauvignon and a Merlot. So, so good. And with that, I finished up the last of my spaghetti and meatballs. It was both mostly just meatballs, so I made a sandwich. But it was from the spaghetti and meatballs. So anyway, I've got my Santa glass right here. So we've got the red side and a green side. don't know if maybe this is the naughty side and this is the good side. I don't know. Anyway, cheers, everyone. I hope everyone is having a fabulous, fabulous Sunday. I hope you had a great weekend. Cheers. Not as good as the Cabernet Sauvignon and Merlot. It's a little tart. I think this one has... <coughs> Excuse me. I think this one has some cranberries in it. It's really tart back here. But there's also probably some strawberries in here. Maybe some raspberries. Maybe cherry. But definitely cranberries are in here. A lot of cranberries. It's very, very tart. I probably should have a glass of water with this. If I start coughing again, I'll take a break and go get one. Alrighty, so fab fit fun. So I got this years ago. I wasn't that impressed with it. And it's been a few years, and about every month they offer it to me or, you know, offer me a free this or a free that. And it just wasn't really enough to maybe entice me to get into it again. So a couple of months ago, they offered me a free box that I would pay for the year in advance. It was like 211 maybe some change right around there. And that would be for the four boxes that you get to 100% customize and that they would give me a free box. So I said, you know, it's got a free box in it. Okay, maybe, and I haven't really seen anyone that was really crazy about everything in the box. I mean, there's a few people that love everything in the box and, you know, that's fine. I mean, everybody's different, but so many people were like, it's not like it was in the olden days. But I thought, you know, there's a free box in here. I'll give it a try, you know, so I did. So I got the first box, and of course you weren't able to customize it. It was stuff they picked out, and one of the reasons that I decided to get into it because I saw some really nice boxes, and I thought, well, you know, if I get a chance to customize, this could be a good box, but I didn't get to customize anything. This one I did, so I printed out the sheets. We'll try to get into it a little bit. Again, didn't really impress me that much. To me, it's, well, we'll get into it. I know everybody loves this box. And a lot of people really, really enjoy the boxing. So I don't want to bring anyone down. Everybody's different. Some boxes are just made for different people. Alrighty, customization number one. So I had a choice of a wraparound robe. Very, very few people looking good in those. I am not one of them. There was a car organizer. I've already got two of those, so didn't need one of those. There was a Laneige Waterbank Serum. Kind of sounded interesting. There was a Free People fringe throw blanket. I love throw blankets. This one had pink in it, so it didn't like it was really going to go with anything at my house. So I said, I think I'll pass. There was a Rebecca Min Minkoff purse in here for a studded crossbody. It looked kind of cute, but it just, just looked like it was more for a teenager. They had a glittery pocketbook with crystals, and you know, that's kind of like my style for wine diaries, but for the money, I'm happy with the ones I've been getting for Timu. Uh, there was a Fenty Skin Watch a Tone, a dark spot serum. I've got freckles on my face, and I've got some strawberry marks, but I really don't need anything like that. They had a short stories that was a tiered app tray. Now, if I was still having a lot of people coming to my house or going to the office and just having boards and things that we do on Fridays, would have been a good choice for me. Um, there was an Elemis Pro Collagen Marine Cream. They had a lot of choices here. They had a three candle votive set, um, a commodity milk expressive. I think that was perfume, but not sure. They had the instant waves, that kind of like thing that you crimp your hair and get some beach waves, and then a rose oil. And the item that I picked was the Elemis. It's got this box right here, was the Pro Collagen Marine Cream. So it's a hydrating day cream. So for fine lines and wrinkles. So I thought that one was the best pick for me. 
and that's the size of the jar. And this has a value of $93. So, I mean, I know I got my money's worth. I totaled everything up that they, I got my box and it was $304. So value-wise, it was a good box, but for me, it just kind of felt like a glorified Ipsy. It wasn't like the fabulous lifestyle that I've seen in the past. All right, but again, I'm different, so everybody's different. Getting on to customization number two, they had these really cute little earrings. Um, had they been real gold and diamonds, I probably would have enjoyed it. But if it's it's just costume jewelry, I mean, I can get cheap costume jewelry. So that wasn't for me. There were three different uh, NARS lip colors. Uh, there was uh, cocktail glasses, like an old-fashioned type glasses, a set of two. Now, they had a really pretty cake stand, and like I said, if I was doing more entertaining and things like that that I used to always do, we always had people over, that would have been perfect, but I'm not anymore. I'm trying to declutter. Uh, there was an eye cream, uh, the same kind of material, the same kind of glass for candlestick holders. Again, if I was into entertaining, it would have been really, really nice. Um, there was a hair serum, um, cheese cheese board like cutting knives and things like that there was an electric toothbrush which probably would have been a really nice choice but I just got one like a couple of weeks before this came out and I really really love my new sonic toothbrush and two more lip colors from NARS or you could have had them pick something the item that I picked that I thought was the best for me was this Elemis this peptide eye recovery cream because yeah tired overworked eyes yeah that's me so anyway this is the box focus please and this is what it looks like and this had a 49 dollar value alrighty so it looks like a good day for Elemis alrighty so customization number three so there was a Quay leave-in conditioner um, there was a coach cable knit winter headband um, there was a peppermint body scrap. Um, there was a lash enhancer serum, serum um, an eyeshadow palette. There was a whey apple cider vinegar exfoliating scalp detox. Now, it's got apple cider in it. And for years, when my mother, you know, I was little, and my mother would wash my hair, she always did apple cider in my hair. She told me it was going to bring out my red highlight switch. I did not want red hair. I did not want red highlights. I don't know if that gave me red highlights. Years later, she said it was mind over matter, and I got red highlights because of the apple cider, because of what she told me, but it really wasn't true. She said the apple cider kept bugs away from your hair. So that's why we always had to have apple cider, because, you know, you never know. Um, then we got, so yeah, I didn't get that. So it was the Irish Sea Moss Beauty Liquid Drops didn't really know what that was. There was a matcha gummy. Yeah, I'm not into matcha tea and gummies unless it's candy. And so out of those choices, I picked this peppermint scrub. And I've seen a few people get this and they said that they've had it before and they enjoyed it. So it's a nice size. I'm going to enjoy using this scrub this winter. It does have a safety seal. I really wanted to smell it. But I think I'm happy with my choice on this. And this had a $32 value. Alrighty, so now I'm on customization number four. So they had um, some wood yoga blocks, which I haven't quite got into yoga yet. There was a party planning membership, so I really didn't need that. There was an under eye mask, which sounded pretty good. Um, they had some scrunchies for your hair, which I, you know, I'm... I mean, a lot of people like them, and I've seen people get them, and they're really, really happy. But if I wanted scrunchies, I can go to Target. I can go to Sally's. I, well, online. Um, you can get them anywhere, so there's nothing special about it. There was an apron. Um, don't really need that. There was the Works Deep Sleep Overnight Cleanser. I know that's got the lavender in it that I usually like, but the Works that smell, it's to me, it's like burnt rubber. It's Yeah, so I wasn't going to get that. They had a travel spray, like a perfume, and then if you lived in certain places, it wasn't everywhere, but you could get $30 credit to have your makeup done at some places, or the mystery choice. So what did I pick? I picked, well, I buried it, but I picked the perfume. I just dropped something very important. 
So anyway, I don't can't see where the writing is, so we'll just put it up. So we've got some writing there. But anyway, this is what it looks like. So I picked this. I think it's got words on it over here. So it's by Rosie Jane. And it's a per size travel thing of perfume. I haven't sprayed, but it smells really nice. It's hard to spray because it's new. Okay, there it goes. So it does have a nice smell right now. It's strong like alcohol. But it's a, a nice kind of like amber, maybe sandalwood. But anyway, it is pretty. Going to enjoy using that. And that had a $28 value. Okay, we're up to customization five. So I could have got a hand cream, hairpins, and it was just like those metal little hairpins. And I'm thinking, why is this like a choice in this box that everybody loves? Um, they had a micro drink, uh, little tablets to put in your drink, and I thought that sounded interesting, but I didn't get it. They had a build your own bracelet kit, but it kind of looked like something that you would get for a little kid. Um, the candle wick things to kind of trim them, but I probably have about a dozen that I got from Yankee Candle. That when you got one of those big candles, you always got them for free. There was a faux fur earmuffs, and I really, really was thinking of them, but I've got a couple of pairs, and so I passed on those, but I did see somebody open them. Oh my god, I wish I had got them. They really, really look nice. Um, there was also two different kinds of personal lubricants. Um, a mystery choice and a probiotic face mask. So, you know, that's what I picked out. And they're by Aceology. They came in this box like this. And so it was a set of four for $59. So, expensive little eye face mask, but I do enjoy them. So that was the best pick for me. So I'm excited to have some more face masks because, you know, I don't have enough. So anyway, that was them. And I think I've got one more category. So number six. So I could have got some, um, a frosted nail lacquer duo, but at the time I was thinking, yeah, don't do nail polish. Otherwise that might've been a good choice. Uh, there was a double layered necklace, but again, it, you know, it, it just was, faux jewelry wasn't anything special about it and I like big and bling if I'm gonna unless it's like real gold real diamonds things like that otherwise if I'm gonna wear fashion jewelry I want something blingy could have got a puppy dog collar don't have a puppy uh, pot holders I can go anywhere and get pot holders um, what was this first skin press restart so a retinol serum that probably could have been a good choice for me there were some hanky panky wash and wear bags so i think those were things you'd put in your travel maybe to put your dirty laundry in mystery you could have got a fakai technicolor a conditioner for your hair and the one that i picked out was the 111 celestial black diamond brightening essence and this had a value uh, $43 so that was what I had picked out for me so everything that I picked out was three hundred and four dollars so I know I got a good value for my money but to me it just I got more skincare items and I was thinking FabFitFun was kind of more like a mix that I would be happy with getting some lifestyle but the lifestyle things just really weren't for me but what I, I did get one add-on and and even though it's not for me, I got the Rebecca Minkoff, this little bag. Again, it's faux. I don't know why they call it faux leather. It's it's fake. It's vinyl. <laughs> you know what I mean? But faux leather makes it sound like it's special. But to me, this just wasn't a bag for an adult. It was it's cute. For was it worth fifty nine dollars when it's not real? No, not really. But it is pretty. And I think for an add-on, it was like $16 for $16. I thought that was good. And this is going to be perfect for a little pre-teen girl that I know. So I think that's going to be her present. And for a teenager, pre-teenager, I think this is perfect. For an adult, not really. But anyway, Rebecca Min Minkoff, I think that's supposed to be a fancy designer. So we'll see. So that was everything that I got. And again, I'm hoping that... This is perfect for a pre-teenager bag. 
So anyway, that was everything that was in my box. And of course, we got the obligatory. We've got um, the HelloFresh, which is really, really a good service. I really enjoyed getting it. Sometimes I think about getting it again. I mean, I'm, I haven't been to the grocery store by myself in a long time. So, I mean, I pay shipped. I think Target has that shipped. So I pay $99 a year. My deliveries are free, but I mean, you're still paying. I think with Target, it's not like Walmart is now that the price is the same. You get sale prices and everything else that you do at the store when you do it online. Because I pay that $99, um, my deliveries are free, but I mean, you still have to tip. So probably what I pay, maybe this is going to be a nice choice for me in the future. So I may or may not go back to that. And we got this FabFitFun thing. So I will probably try to do that and see if I'm the big winner. If I am, I will let you know. And um, let's see. So there's this coupon for the HelloFresh. Like I said, it really is a nice service, especially if you're you're working, you don't have much time to plan meals, go to the grocery store, or you want to get it for, you know, someone that's a caregiver or for maybe your elderly parents that really can't do the shopping and things like that anymore. It's got awesome, awesome choices, step-by-step -step directions. Food is fresh. It's really tasty. So you can always freeze that if you wanted to try it for yourself. And three surprise gifts. And then they also sent a little notice uh, from Netflix for this original movie with Jennifer Gardner, Family Switch. And that came out on November 30th. All right, so that was everything that was in my box. I am so sorry this ran into some extra time. So happy you guys were able to stop in. And I appreciate you guys so much. I hope everyone goes out, has a fabulous day fabulous week. Take care, everyone. Stay safe. Be kind. Be happy. Enjoy life. Have some fun. Love you guys so much, and we will see you in our next video. Bye-bye.